what is an epiretinal membrane? Well, some patients uh, develop a layer of scar tissue on the surface of the retina or photographic film at the back of the eye called an epiretinal membrane. It also goes by the term cellophane maculopathy. This thin layer of scar tissue does two things. It first impairs light getting to the retina, resulting in blurring of central vision, but it also, as scar tissue likes to do elsewhere in the body, contracts. And as it contracts, it can wrinkle the underlying retina, and this results in distortion of vision. The scar tissue that's formed on the surface of the central retina is often associated with a degenerative change that occurs within the jelly that occupies the main eye cavity. The jelly is called vitreous and with the passage of time becomes more watery in its consistency and this watery consistency allows cells, including scar tissue cells, to move around freely inside the eye and then the scar tissue cells form a sheet on the surface of the central retina where they then contract, wrinkle the underlying retina and cause the problem. Because this is a mechanical problem with scar tissue on the surface of the retina, it requires a mechanical problem to treat which requires an operation called a vitrectomy to get inside the eye and then peel off the scar tissue with a surgical operation. Mm -hmm.